intestine zili burst food yenye alikuwa amekula ita imeota kwa anajisaidia kama ugika kwa tumbo so tumbo yote ilikuwa ina kasuage kuna watu fulani wana post tiktok na facebook at rip really yes so ni kwa ni ki receive calls so watu wananiambia ti pole so nauliza mnaniambia pole juu nini exactly mm -hmm. Wananitumia hizo nitakutumia utaona kuna mtu anaeka RIP Hello Chuko family my name is Kimori Wangeshi and welcome to this episode of my story Now picture yourself as a show stopper and a hype man at one moment but the next minute you have a stomach ache and the doctor tells you that your intestines have ruptured What do you do after that Let's get to hear the story of one Peter Miracle Baby Karo, kwanza pole sana Thank you. kwa yale ambayo wamepata familia yako. Uh, but we are here as Tuko family to hear the story and see how uh, we can work with you through this journey because it's a difficult moment. Mm. I have seen pictures flying around in social media and uh, we've got this information. But it is better for us to understand it kutokana na wewe. Ndiyo maana tumekuja. Kwa wale hawa kujui, Fadhali ji introduce. Mene itua karoka tu na mimi ndo bibi ya Miracle Baby. Now we are here because of Miracle Baby, your husband. What happened? So 2018, alianza the same same problem ya tumbo. So sa hizi ndi tunakujanga ku understand, pia yu time ilikuwa obstruction ya intestine. Ukiwa na obstruction ya intestine, ato ukifanyiwa CT scan, inonyesha nga kama hii ni intestine kutoka hapa, di hapa kuna kitu ime block hivyo hivyo. So hospital yenye tulimpeleka 2018, after wamepiga CT scan wali conclude ati akona growth. Na wakasema wakimfanyi hii operation wana mtuwa growth. So after wamefanyi operation yao na wakamfunganisha, Tukajaribu kuambia tuonyesheni ibasi zo growth zenye mmetua na wakakuwa resistant. Mm -hmm. Tukona aju, sasa hamekuwa sawa, hacha tusishine, tukifuatilia sana. So, 2023 May, mm -hmm. tumbo teni kanza kuleta shida. Mm -hmm. So, kumpeleka husi ya kambu wafanyiwe ultrasound onekane shida ni gani. Mm -hmm. Wakati walifanya ultrasound waka ona appendix haiko visible. Mm -hmm. Wakasema acha warudie na CT scan, juu CT scan ndio inasema ngukweli yote. Mm -hmm. Ikonekana kuna appendix. So tukajua hiyo hospitali walimtoa appendix wakadanganya wamemtoa wamemtoa hizo growth. Mm -hmm. So since hiyo time jota walirudisha nisha hizo vitu vibaya. So juu hivyo walirudisha nisha carelessly na wakatoa appendix na hadi hawakusema juu ukitolewa appendix kuna Unafuwa ambio vitu zenyo fei kula hivyo. Hakuna kitu walifungu ama aliembo wa skule? Apana. Awaku muambia kitu yoto. Walimpatia tudawa na waka ambia ende home after three days. So, after sisa tumejua hivyo. So, unapatanga intestines. Zake zinakaa zinajikunjanisha. Tunenda husiku na dawa naikewa. Zinafungu kana. On and off. 2018 eh? But Peter is a very active person, mm. vile tunamjua, mm. kwa kudance, kama ni kuhype shows. Mm. Bado alikuwa na yoshida. Alikuwa na yoshida. Mm -hmm. So, I kuangia ti ni kila time, unapata, ataka kama mwaka moja, ama miezi kata, no, mm. then inarudi, yoshida inarikate, na inarudi. Mm -hmm. So, ikirudi, tunenda husi, anaike wadawa flani kwa line, inafungukana, ivo. Mm -hmm. So, on Sunday, tulikuwa tunenda event ya DJ Dibul. Mm -hmm tumbo ikaanza kumuuma. So tukamrush hosi, tukidhani ni venye tu tunaendanga na dungu ya shindano anatulia tunaenda huko. Mm -hmm. So kukuja wakati waliona tumbo juu ilikuwa imefika huko ilikuwa imekufura. Hii ilikuwa na inflammation kubwa sana. Mhm. Mm so wakase, wa, after amemweka pen kile ya kumtuliza wakamwambia atuwezi kuruhusu uende home kwanza. Acha saje na kuja kuone aseme kama ni sawa uende ama ubaki. Mm -hmm. So, uh, tukatumwa CT scan tena. CT scan kutumwa tukona bado wakona yu obstruction ya intestine. Njera tukimleta, yeah. aku wanaenda kujisaidia na aku wanakula juu. Akikula unawana nini zimejifunganisha, mm -hmm. ayezi nini itoke. Mm -hmm. Nata zenye alikuwa mekula stila ziezi toka. Mm -hmm. So, sisi tukafanya yu CT scan na kuonekana ni obstruction. 
wakamjaribu dawa za kumdunga ikakataa wakamweka pipe fulani ijaribu kama itapunguza hiyo inflammation ama itafungwanisha mm-hmm. so on one is the uh, subuhi akaanza kuongea vitu azieleweki anaanza kusema eh hey, anaona amefika mwisho ai nikashangaa kwa nini anaongea hivyo so mimi nikaita daktari haraka mm-hmm. na wakati sajo nalikuja akamwangalia akapelekwa surgery very urgent so after ametoka ndo tukaambiwa intestine zili bust food yenye alikuwa amekula ile time yote alikuwa anajisaidia kama ngika kwa tumbo so tumbo yote ilikuwa na kasuage so tukaonyeshwa hadi juu kuna mara zilitolewa juu zilichomeka mm-hmm. zikatolewa zikaekwa kando na akaoshwa akarudishanishwa batata hapa side ametolewa intestines hapo cho itokea hapo mm-hmm. then after wamemfunganisha waka notice kuna mahira hizo eh mm-hmm. waka notice kunazo hapo kwa kidonda jo amefanywa isajaria hivi na katikati mm-hmm. so wakafungwanisha wakatoanisha hizo mauzi tena wakamweka vac machine ya kuvuta infection juu infection tena ilikuwa inakuja jo all that time alikuwa na kaka oxygen ulikuwa unapata adia anatumia mitungi kaa tatu so oxygen yake ikitolewa iko 76 pulse rate iko 154 ilikuwa juu sana juu ya uchungu pia mm-hmm. so akamtoanisha wakamweka hiyo vac machine sasa hizi hata sasa hizi ndio ako nayo inavuta hizo uchafu mm-hmm. yeah. karo Mm. Saizi unaongea na at least na ukakamavu ama na a little bit of courage. When all this was happening, mm. ni nini kilikuwa kinaendelea kwa mind yako kwamba ulikuwa una feel gani? Au una feeling gani? Ah ilikuwa normal sana ju. We ilikuwa ngumu kwa sababu mimi nilikuwa najaribu kujipatia hope but on the other hand unajua still a coin denial. Zinge kwa kama ni ugonjwa wengine mm-hmm. unaweza jua ah nikienda hosi nitafanywa hivi na hivi ia kile happen so fast so alikuwa still ako in denial unapata sasa anaanza kuongea vitu sasa mimi hata nikijaribu nijipatie moyo aniseme eh hey, ni sawa atakuwa poa unapata on the other hand nikienda side yake na niambia isioni nikitoboa tisini sini nenda anga hosi mara mingi but haijaifikia hapo unaona mm-hmm. so ah imekuwa ni ngumu kujaribu kumsikizisha ndio accept ati hadi cho itakuwa inatokea side ju ameambiwa intestines zitaka nje for six weeks then after hizo six weeks atarudi tena surgery zirudishwe mm. na unasema kuna part ili tolewa like ili kato ikatolewa kwa sababu ilikuwa imechomeka eh yeah. kuna hizo zilitolewa part kubwa sana mm-hmm. mm. na mostly badaktari wanasema the cost ni nini cost ya yo hivyo kubasti mm-hmm alikuwa na infection kwa tumbo. Mm-hmm. Eh, so ukiweza kuwa na infection i react that's why ili ilipasuka hivyo. Alafu eh ilikuwa complicated. Jetu sajun mwenye alimfanyia alijaribu. Aliingia ngavieta saa 5 na 23 alikuwa anatoka saa 9 na 50. Eh. Alingangana sana juu. I don't know me na mdank na bado na dank Mungu juu kama ingefanywa na mtu mwingine sijui sasa hizi tumekuwa tunaongea story gani mm-hmm. na kama hange rasho immediately akae another two hours ange angeenda really eh hey. it was that bad kwa sababu wakati hiyo nini ili bust nini kama ngika kwa tumbo hewa yake ilianza kuenda chini jina deni sue ali tulikuwa tunaambiwa alifunganishwa kulikuwa kuna ka sewage na sasa najua hiyo nini na choma so ingeenda ikichoma ngo hivyo vitu then sasa kwa sana story nyingine sasa. Mhm. Mm. Uh, from my understanding, mm. uja toka hospitali is that the reason umeva ngoza hosi? Mhm, mimi na vasa sasa ngoza hospitali from day one is day and a home. Eh na kanga na yetu kuzi napata ananida apelekwe choo, utapata kuna vitu anahitaji nimfanyie joto ikipanda na na mrins, migui kifura na mfanyia massage hivyo so sijii toka hosi tangu day one mhm hebu mm. sasa tuelezee hiyo journey ya recovery kutoka kwa surgery hadi hapa eh hiyo siku yako inakaaje na unieleze hizo machine tumeona vile zina operate so mimi naweza sema tangu hata iko hiyo vac machine mm-hmm. sasa hizi imekuwa beta vac unaita vac ni vacuum eh ni vacuum mm-hmm. Bet sasa nikatu vacuum ile yenye na fagang carpet sasa hiyo mm-hmm. 
unaona amefungwanishwa kidonde ilifungwanishwa yote mm -hmm. unaona ndani mm -hmm wakaikelea sponge flani then kuna pipe na connectiwa hapo so inavute hiyo uchafu iko ndani so tanguweko hiyo at least amekuwa at peace unapata hadi hiyo infection inapungua juu joto ilikuwa inapanda juu hadi karibu wa converse mm -hmm. eh ilikuwa inaenda juu kabisa juu hiyo ilikuwa ime damage sana huko ndani mm. so hata sasa hizi alitolewa nini oxygen juzi Saizi at least nini yake na stabilize inachezea 90 ikishuka sana ni 88 na rudi na shoot tena 91 hivyo jua mm -hmm. na shinda akiwa monitored ionekane na pulse rate saizi imetulia inachezea 110 109 na ilikuwa 154 mm -hmm. yeah. uh, cost zinakaje so tangu hiyo time yote mpaka the 23 mm -hmm. bill ilikuwa 1.2 So tulikuwa tume cover 210 then sasa karangoa kakuja jana akasaidia tukarezio 1 million na 20000 but sasa hiyo ili clear kutoka day 1 mpaka day 23 mm -hmm. so hizi zingine kuendelea bado atujui atatujui itakuja ngapi cuz alichenjiwa dawa akaanza kupatiwa moxil zingine strong na expensive sana mm -hmm. na unapata hako ka bug kenye yo colostomy eh yo colostomy mm -hmm. ni very expensive kamoja ni 7500 so hizo cost zinakuwa ziko juu sana mm -hmm. mm. na pia ako ka, ka machine ako ka vacu adeni 20k na anakanayo wiki hiyo machine yenye na motion hiyo yenye navuta eh mm -hmm. na pia kuchange yako unajua ako kanini umeona kanaingia hiyo uchafu haiwezi oshwa ati irudishwe hapo juu infection tena inaweza rudi so ikija inatupwa hiyo una nuno nyingine tena na kuna nuno nyingine ni 4k on top of the 20000 eh hey. mm. how are you managing karo so si tunangangana tuko na friends wanasaidia deni situmbia na amekuwa supportive sana hata before tapita gonjeke music yetu ana supporting sana Ah, uh, Moses Kuria, kina Waitha Kawajen, Karango. Yaani watu wengi sana wana try venye wataweza kutusupport na pia tuko na fans wetu kutoka UK so pia wao wana wanasaidia saidia tunapunguza punguza. But so far hiyo bill ya kutoka day 1 mpaka day 23 iko cleared. Mm -hmm. But sasa hizi ya Mogzila aliandikia hata ni venye sikumbuki jina ya hiyo dawa. Mm -hmm. Ah. Hizo ziko expensive sana. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm na wewe eh, nguvu inatoka wapi ama lazima ukue strong for him for the two of you sasa unajua inabidi nikif kama hata kama ninaona si kuzuri nenda na lilia mbali nikiona nifike mali yako sasa na muonyesha hai ni kitu kidogo sasa hatuwezi muonyesha ati sisi wote ati ni, ni kama issue ni kubwa mm -hmm. eh sana mm -hmm. eh allow me to ask eh? mm -hmm. unajua your story mm -hmm. eh, is in the public domain. Mm. So sasa kama kuna watu watasema hii swali ni insensitive but let me just ask. Mm. Eh, kuna baby mamas mm. wanakuwa wakimfightia. Mm. Where are they? Ah kwa Miss John hata mmoja. Hata ile kupiga simu kuuliza akwaje niliona ni hakuna hata mmoja. Hakuna. Mm -hmm. Wewe ndio unangangana naye peke yako. Eh. Leo ah. nasema anga au wanatokea anga wakati walikuwa wanafanya hivyo wapate jina joto wengine walikuwa kujiekelea si wa ukweli mm -hmm. eh walikuwa wamekuja tu kuharibu jina tu eh sasa hizi hawako ni mimi niko tu huku tunakaa na brother ya Pitahu si madewa anakuja juu niko na akatotoka dogo mm -hmm. so tunashinda nako asubuhi then usiku wanaenda wanalala na kina madhe na letewa tena asubuhi juu kana nyonya kana kuja tunakaa nako then ana and I was actually about to ask her, mm. how are you managing as a mother na nimepata information kwamba pia huyo kijana mm. eh, he was not well uh, like uh, a week ago of what happened the dronics katotoke mm -hmm. tuwe aka kukua poa nako kalikuwa kameanza issue ya conversion mm -hmm. november kakuwa admitted still issue ya conversion alikuwa pia yeye kwa oxygen december the same same bed yenye pita ako alikuwa hapo that same bed eh. that same bed eh hiyo eh, tulikuwa tumekaleta huku 
So pia ye tuka admitiwa a whole week but sasa saizi kako beta hiyo hiyo shi DJ jirudia but na ye alikuwa na infection ya huku mm -hmm. alikuwa na vidondo huku but sasa wali treat poa na saizi ya kwa saa mm -hmm. So how are you managing eh, wewe huja toka hospitali mm. since eh, mulikuja hapa nini? Sunday Last Sunday mm. 20, was it 20th or 21st? Ilikuwa ni 20th mm -hmm. Huja mm. toka hapa how have you been managing with the Sunday was 21st? Eh unako kimanejaje na mtoto mdogo hivi? Sana nakwambia mama anamleta asubuhi tunashinda na yeye ikifika around saa 2 saa 3 usiku anamchukua wanaenda na yeye huko. Eh kwake analala na yeye then asubuhi tena pia wameshinda hii barabara wakikuja. Ju lazima wamlete asubuhi ashinda kinyonya then akienda usiku anakunywa nani <laughs> api hiyo nani kuna jua na kunywa nga after meal na kana ako simuona vya ni kanono <laughs> kana kunywa <laughs> napata hiyo kana kana nako kadogo hata akamalizi siku tatu <laughs> jina na usiku mzima hiyo ndia nashinda kikunwa <laughs> yeah. e, familia imegongwa eh? kini mungu yuko mm. na wale marafiki wako personally I would like to thank them mm. E, kwa sababu kama si wao kukuja kukuona tungepata hii information mm. e, ni watu wengi ambao wanapitia hali kama yako na hawana njia kufikia mm. watu wengi mm. so we also appreciate your friends and your fans and we also calling upon our fans as well our audience mm. both locally and internationally wa weze kusimama na wewe wakue among the counted when walisimama na familia ya Peter mm. na Karo wish you the very best. E, kuna jambo lingine ambalo ungetaka kusema? Ningetaka kuongeza. Mm -hmm. Kuna watu fulani wana post TikTok na Facebook at RIP. Really? Yes. So nimekuwa niki receive calls. So watu wananiambia ti pole. So nauliza mnaniambia pole juu nini exactly? Mm -hmm. Wananitumia hizo nitakutumia utaona. Kuna mtu anaeka RIP. So ningetaka ku clarify juu simu zimekuwa zikiingia mingi siwezi chukua zote. Mm -hmm. Pita ako sawa, hajakufa so mwenye na anajaribu kumua yeye ndiye atakufa wa kwanza. Eh. Hey. It's very bad manners. Yeye ntabia mbaya. Uh, people chasing clout with. Juu hata siwezi taka ajui kitu kai juu yeye mwenyewe atakizoona. Mm -hmm. Kai hiyo anaweza ta give up. Mm -hmm. Yeye ntabia mbaya watu wache kuandika information awajui. Mm -hmm. Eh. Hey. That is very bad mtu akijaribu kutafuta numbers na mm. health ya mtu hey. but you can also clarify that uh, from the doctor's report vile amekuwa akikuja kumwangalia he is recovering well mimi vile nimemuona mm. e, nimeona ni mtu ana respond eh hey, akusawa but sasa kuongea aongee mm. sana kwa sababu akianza kuongea sana oxygen yake inarudi chini mm -hmm. na ama akiongea sana anaanza ku hiccup kidonde na siku chungu mm -hmm. but tunaweza sema ame improve ju hata umempata utaona hizo picha kuna ma paper alikuwa na amerushwa alikuwa na oxygen alikuwa na nini mm -hmm. so sasa hizi tunaweza sema ako sawa kwa sababu zimefungwa fungwa alikuwa na makatheta mm -hmm. alikuwa na pipe zingine huku mm -hmm. ai ilikuwa crazy mm -hmm. eh mbona uh, umemwekea fan hiyo fan mm -hmm. joto inapanda vibaya Nona still unaona hiyo vac kama umeangalia yako ka container mm -hmm. kuna uchafu mwingi sana inatoka hiyo mm -hmm. ni infection infection ikiwa juu mm -hmm. unapata hata hiyo ndio ilikuwa reason ya mto hii ku converse juu ulikuwa unapata fever inapanda inakuja 40 ikikuja 40 ana converse aya anaanza kwa mwili kwa stiff the same thing ukiwa na infection juu yake iko kwa tumbo joto inapanda vibaya na that's why umesikia nikisema kuna mali nimekwambia na shina ni kimrins kakitamba kabaridi I'm na eh mm -hmm. hata si kusweat fever iko juu mm -hmm. so nina mrin sivo fan nina shinde kikaon mm -hmm. eh alafu lazima miguni shinde ni kimassage unaona siwezi kutembea haizi kutembea anatembea kama mtoto anajifunza kutembea mm -hmm. juu kuna hizo sindano anadungwa huku mm -hmm. miguu na kuwa weak eh so anatembezwa tu pole pole juu tuliambiwa tuspom tembeza hivyo na akitembea na siku chungu tuspom tembeza hivyo atapona kidonda then turudi tuende kwa therapy 
anze tena sasa atini kufunzo kutembea kama mtoto mdogo ya so anapati wadi madawa za kuzuia damu isi clot juu napata anaka position moja yeah. that's why ta umepata hiyo recliner seat ilibidi ninunue juu ya kuketi ili ni cost 62k eh cuz aliambo lazima ana tray kuketi juu kwa bed anashinda position moja amelala hivi juu so anaanza kutokea vidonda na nyuma eh bed so, sores mm, so that's why tuka nuno hiyo kiti ana try ana kaka chini juu na juu operation ya katikati na kuanga tricky sana. Uwezi kaa ujikunje hivi na video umeka tu hivi. Sasa mm -hmm. hata kwa bed unaona kuna kitu ninamwekea hapa hivi. Hivyo akikaa kwa kiti hiyo kitu unaona imekuwa venye atajichukua hivyo ndio akuwe comfortable mgongo na miguu je venye inafura iko iko mahali juu. Mm -hmm. mm. Mkiruka mwaka 2024. Mm. Did you imagine that you'll find yourself in this situation? Imagine no. Hata tulishtuka Jana tu tulienda kanisa sasa unashangaa shetani jamani anatuliza nini. Mm -hmm. Si tu kwa tunadhania na hata saizi ameambiwa anatafutiwa psychologist. Ni psychologist mm -hmm. inasema ngo hivyo mm -hmm. aongeleshwe juu still ako in denial. Eh ajakubali venye kuko. Unapata anaenda anaongea vitu zingine ama kama amelala unapata anamka anataka kuvuruta hizo mapipe. Eh yani anakani kama ayu, ayuko sawa then kuna issue nilikuwa nimeanza ni yale kwa producer so napata every time na mka nastuka na niuliza atupigi show unaona aja kubali hiyo kitu ati saizi haizi amka aende venye alikuwa anaenda ni ngumu jutulia mbo kama ingekuwa ni kitu alikuwa anajua eh nikiumona tumbo hivi nita inanifanyo surgery nikae this and this hivyo ingekuwa better but it happened so fast so aja aja adapt bado na aja kubali pole sana i think at this point ndio urudi anaweza kaa peke yake kwanza haizi kaa peke yake mm -hmm. lazima mtu amsaidie kumpeleka washroom lazima ashinde amerinsiwa lazima ikiwe food apewe eh that's why you here eh that's why she is in the home mm -hmm. eh in 247 uko hapo eh na lala kwa hiyo kitu umeona hapo na usiku oh, of course kuna madaktari wanakuja usiku eh huko wako na services poa sana mm -hmm. eh usiku kuna madaktari wanakuja kuangalia mm -hmm. la sasa unajua yeye anashinda akiwa monitored juu ya oxygen ndio in case umeona hapo tu saidi yake kuna oxygen hapo ni in case ianze kuleta shida haraka aekewe mm -hmm. karo mm -hmm. eh mmetengeneza pay bill ama ni njia gani ambayo mtu anaweza kusupport eh, Pay bill, mm -hmm. pay bill iko but iko na issue. Mm -hmm. So tunatumia tu namba ya simu mm -hmm. yangu. Mm -hmm. Na ni 0794 tena. 0794 mm -hmm. na jina ni Carol Mudoni Mbudia. Carol Mudoni Mbudia. Eh Mbudia. Carol Mudoni Mbudia. Mm Haya -hmm. basi. Eh mwambie whatever they have eh hey, ukiza kwa na anything unaweza taka to support sisi tuta appreciate kwa sababu wako ka bag ni very expensive akitoka hosi hata need kukuwa na nas kwa nyumba cuz ni lembo mimi siwezi change your bag lazima kuna venye wanafanya sijui heri na fake with dry kabisa mimi siwezi jua kufanya so lazima tuchukue nas kwa nyumba lazima hiyo ka bag na moja ni 7500 lazima uh, lazima hizo madawa natoka hizo dawa atapatiwa za kumeza ni very expensive eh hey. <laughs> so mtu akiweza kuwa anataka kutuma any support tunaweza appreciate mm -hmm. final question what has this situation done to your family we imefanya tu aidha <laughs> kwa poa mm -hmm. cuz unapata sasa hata show hatuwezi enda tunaitiwa show mm -hmm atuwezi enda kuperform kwa sababu tunaenda ikiwa package mimi na ye. Yeah. so atuwezi enda show mm -hmm. unapata hata hiyo show yenye nilianza kupiga kwa tv last friday siku enda ilibidi merudiwa kwa sababu mimi sikuwa na hiyo nguvu mm -hmm. so unapata inarudisha mambo zetu nyuma sana mm -hmm. eh kwa sasa mtoto apati love yake 
Napata nenda na angalia babaki juu anamtezesha anga sana. Mm -hmm. So akifika mali yako anaanza kufanya vitu za mchezo anaona ongi. Pia yeye inampatia stress. Bibi hata akakuli pia yeye. Mm -hmm. Ni kama hata yeye anaelewa kuna venye hakuna kitu inaenda hapo hapo. Mm -hmm. Alright, pole sana Karo, mm. na tunawatokia kila laheri. Mm. Tuko family, as we usually do, we support one of us. Uh, Karo and Peter are now part of us as a family. And I pray that whatever you have, the little that you have, you help this family with. Uh, you can use the number that Karo has given us. They have been a vibrant family, an entertaining family in this country. And right now, they need us also to support them. This has been their story, this is Carol's story, this is Peter's story. Let's make it a miracle for them, just as their name or his name goes, Miracle Baby. My name is King Oriwangeshi. This has been my story right here on Tuko. Let's do this, guys.